Hi, son. Hey there. Can I help you? I take it your next report's ready. My report? Everything is fine, as it should be. How are things going? I am pleased to report that I have nothing to report. Your thoughts? I can't deny that the HQ has a certain splendor about it. I'll see you later. Yes? What do you think we should do? There's a lot of radiation up here. Vault 81 used rad scrubbers to decontaminate returning residents. Perhaps something similar could be done here. Never mind. soul building up towns with those pre-war gadgets yeah that's me that's exciting i've been hoping to meet you and here you are wandering right into our humble right i lost a bet i owe that good robot a cannibal i figured if you wanted to at least a week before sending in a rescue you don't get the hell out of here and are you kidding there's more of you keep talking to her like that and i'll shoot you myself doesn't look like you bastards alone for this world anyhow. The machine is not the important part. You can't simply take matters into your own hands when things are moving too slow. If you're important, look at the injection site. After all these years, I should hope I have a steadier hand than that. Unless you also wish to accuse me of becoming old and rickety. I didn't mean... I'd be glad to help if I can. Hey. Oh, it's you. I'm glad you're here. We have a situation developing, one you should really be made aware of. We've had somewhat of an outbreak, an illness that's been going around the HQ's personnel. It's not too serious. No one's died yet, but it has incapacitated at least a quarter of our staff, not to mention the stress it's put on the HQ's plumbing. How exactly did this happen? I suspect it's due to the influx of staff. Lots of people in a confined space breathing the same air It was bound to happen sooner or later. We often had similar problems in Vault 81. A single person has a cough today, the entire vault has it tomorrow. That's quite a predicament. Spilling your coffee is a predicament. This is a dilemma. And if left alone, may very well evolve into a full-blown crisis. We've... no one here with the expertise to deal with this. So I suggest you find someone who can. Preferably an individual with pharmaceutical training. Or barring that, an individual at least capable of spelling pharmaceutical. What exactly are we looking for? As previously mentioned, somebody with pharmaceutical training would be ideal. Uh -huh. However, beggars... Uh -huh. I know someone that might be able to help. I believe we've come to the same conclusion. You speak of the Nightingales, yes? I had heard you'd already had some dealings with them. I believe there's a chance one of their members might consider joining us if we ask nicely. Last I heard, the Nightingales had set up just outside Diamond City. So I'd start your search there. Um, I suppose I should say... Uh, good luck? I hope it goes well? Bye now. Welcome back. As resolved as I was when I made my little speech to Fiona, I have to admit, actually leaving is harder than I thought. Doesn't help that my joints aren't as excited about new trails as they used to be. What are you gonna do now, Doctor? Hopefully, find a place where I can conduct my research in peace, quiet, and 
Preferably with respect from the locals. We need your help, Doctor. Oh, what a coincidence. I'd heard of your HQ and was actually thinking about visiting. Maybe even bring over a mute cake. Now it seems I don't need an excuse to nose around. <laughs> I'll make my way there as soon as I've made my final goodbyes. Ooh, wait till you see the. F <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> personnel being sick look maybe you should just start by treating our staff if you're successful then perhaps we can offer you a permanent position here how very generous of you you can't just take over whatever space you please oh how rude of me you go through all this effort in recruiting a medical expert to help manage an outbreak and in she comes and says hey well, Yes, there you are. That's exactly it. There's something we, we may need, need your expertise with this outbreak, but that doesn't mean you're hired. So yet. what's our situation? You're not even listening while I try to, to explain the symptoms the we've seen. Strain of influenza, not the worst virus, but I doubt you want your security teams taking breaks to hurl. Can you help? I can treat it. Yes. There's no point. What do you mean, no point? It's what you're here for, isn't it? That's right, Cedric. But there's little point in treating it until the root cause is addressed. You just said it. The flu is the root cause. It's the cause for the illness, not the outbreak itself. Tell me, are all the staff living in the same quarters, sharing beds, rooms, toothbrushes? Excuse me? Who do you take me for? Of course I have my own toothbrush. Uh, although, now that you mention it, I have seen other staff members sharing their toiletries i thought so my medical advice more beds their own rooms preferably more than one bathroom and definitely their own hygienic supplies yes we all wish for more privacy some of us more than others but we just don't have the space to give everyone their own rooms really am i hearing this right in this massive building there is no space for additional rooms or beds well, there is a collapsed sublevel we found, but I've declared it out of bounds for staff. It's not safe. There's odd noises and odors. I think there might be feral ghouls down there. Are there any other options? Well, no. Sounds like just what we need right now. Uh, but uh, there's monsters down there. <sighs> Would you be a dear and clear the nasty, spooky ferals out of the sublevel? Of course I'll help. Count me in. You will? Oh, that'll be a relief. Though, I suppose you could also assign the task to a security team, if you don't need them elsewhere. <coughs> the sublevel is accessible via the main elevator. I had disabled the button leading to that floor, but I'll order it reactivated. Once this has been dealt with, I can start treating people. You can find me here. Cedric has been kind enough to let me choose where I set up. What? Oh, of course. <sighs> I think... I think I'll take a small break. Rest my eyes for a bit. I'll be setting my stuff up while you deal with the ferals downstairs. <laughs>
come down. Over there. Go, go, go! Job team. I'm told the residence situation will be resolved soon, meaning we can stop wasting time and finally address this outbreak. To do this, I'll need some equipment set up, and the cooperation of your other departments, of course. Maybe also some assistance, but only if they're mute. What are you talking about? Once I have a working lab, I'll be able to assign teams to research any disease that may be causing us trouble. Then develop cures and vaccines. With the resources of this HQ, I believe we can do something I never before considered possible. We could actually manufacture and distribute vaccines across the entire Commonwealth. Of course, I'm also at your disposal for any other medical or scientific projects you may have for me. But first, let's start with this flu going around. Assign the project, and I can begin researching whatever virus strain the cat dragged in this time.
Hey. Why, hello. Your thoughts? This place is livelier than I expected. It's a good thing I've perfected selective deafness. Now I gotta work on blindness. I'll see you later. Hey. Let's go. Okay. Your thoughts? Let's go. Setting my stuff up while you deal with the ferals downstairs. Next person that asks. <laughs> <laughs> From what I've seen, nobody out here's got it easy.
you are. The flu has been banished from our little fortress, and our gentle Lupe has been kind enough to get the vaccines out to the surrounding settlements. That's one illness you'll see much less of out there. That fact alone is a massive step for the common good. <sighs> I find tangible progress refreshing. I look forward to whatever comes next. What's our next move? My personal recommendation is to not wait for outbreaks. Instead, get us to research other vaccines as a preventative measure. But if you have other projects in mind, tech, meds, weapons, chems, then my team is at your service. You've done good work. We should be all thanking you for making this possible, not the other way around. But still, your words are appreciated. Warning. Overdue for me. Just saying hello. Welcome back. What's on your mind? Teresa's be- Bye. I think a field trip is in order. Stretch my legs. Show my assistants how to harvest rad scorpion venom properly. I do for you how are things going hmm? oh everything is swell smooth and polished your thoughts for how hard you work perhaps you should consider taking a rest some days anything you want to talk about I think you have things well in hand bye <laughs> 